Okay, and... Okay, and... Go ahead, Chuck. Yep. Say action, Victor. A little quicker. And action. Black tie is the norm for most award shows, but at the MTV Awards, black tie is interpreted a little bit more creatively. Um, how would you describe this look? I just got some boots on, some Timberland boots, some Gap jeans, a Michigan sweatshirt. Because I got the M. So in case nobody knows who I am, I'm the M. My look, what, this look right here? Yeah. Oh, because you're a fashion girl, right? Yeah, you got it, babe. You got that fashionable show, and you want to talk about fashion. The most fashionable well, show. This is, um, I got this at a thrift store in London, England for about three pounds. And, Six dollars. Uh, somebody gave these to me last night at the show. These I've had for about eight years because they're Gary Allen specials. Um, some girl gave me her father's Indianapolis Raceway Eagle commemorative tonight at the show. Um, I got these three rings in New Orleans about a week ago. Which three? Uh, these three right here. <laughs> so Stephanie, what are, who are you wearing tonight? Whose dress is this? Giorgio St. Angelo. I thought I thought I could guess that. Um, did you go shopping for it yourself or did someone else help you pick it out? I just went this morning. Okay, the big thing now, as you know, for men and women, shoulder pads. And I think it's an important thing. It makes you look good. It gives you that cut, you know, like that, uh, like you work out kind of a look. And uh, like if you take a look at my shoulder pads, they look. It looks nice. It looks like I have big shoulders. In fact, my shoulders end right here. Okay. So how would you describe your look tonight? I'm wearing a Todd Oldham. Uh, he gave it to me for my birthday. I have a matching purse. It's my Dolores Del Rio look for the evening. My Grecian goddess. What are you wearing tonight? To tell you the truth. To go against the grain, how I'm really like, I went to Gianni Versace in Milan and I bought this. Yeah. I'm wearing Versace too. Oh, wow. So, yeah, we're twins. Wow. I would like to show you my MTV nails. Why are they MTV nails? It's a festive occasion. I'm out here at the, the awards and I wanted to have MTV nails. Tell me about these pants. These are great. Oh, well, oh, thank you so much. You know, they're uh, some like leather pants with some cannabis leaves on them. That this amazing person named Karen Dusenberry made for me. She made them for you? Oh yeah. What's cannabis? <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> this is like a great outfit you're wearing. Tell me a little bit about this and what it means. Well you know the clock, you know it represents time being a very important element that can't afford to be wasted, you know, and you know each minute that we live our lives we got to use each second to the best value. Is it fun getting ready for an event like this? It's a little nerve-wracking, you know, you want to look really good and you're you're going at it for about two hours. <laughs> you're always rushed for time. It's always those last-minute things that get you. I'm confessing that it took me about three hours to get ready for tonight. How about you guys? It's great. Yeah, it took, it's, 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 it took us four. It takes us about four hours to do total hair, makeup, and get dressed. Is it fun getting um, ready for an event like this and deciding what you're going to wear? Oh, wow. Uh, nah. Actually, what I was going to wear wasn't, wasn't difficult at all. I just threw on what was kind of clean. Do you have fun getting ready for these kind of things? I mean, do you even think about what you're going to wear beforehand or you just put uh, it on? I actually asked Flea, I said, Flea, what should I wear? And he went, I don't know, what should I wear? And I said, I don't know, let's wear vests. And so we both, what about this thing here? This is like called my Versace S&M kind of bondage number. 